take a trip to my house. Hey guys, what is happening? I'm the Gaming Sensations and today we're doing a little tutorial on how to install mods and today's mod is going to be Ray's Minimap or whatever you guys actually want to call it, Map Mini, Map Mini, whatever you guys actually want to call it um, and once again I do have this beautiful picture of my sheep that's being created by the Gaming Sensations of course and don't mind these videos that are made by, um, that are uh, frap files, uh, well AVI files and stuff that were recorded by Fraps. Don't worry, you guys will be seeing them eventually. But let's forget about that for now. Let's just get into the video on how to pretty much you know, install a mod on Minecraft 1.6.1. Yeah, 1.6.1, which it is kind of well, it's not exactly a headache if you guys know what you're doing. Um, I messed around with this a little bit, found out what I should actually do uh, on how to install a mod. So let's get into it. Simply open up the 1.6.2 uh, Minecraft launcher, and as you can see, this happens. And for some reason, mine slightly lags. I don't know why. Like it takes a couple seconds for it to actually load, as you can see here. And well, my mouse isn't going to be showing because Camtasia crashes on me when I go to save and edit and stuff. But let's forget about that. Let's just wait for this. Okay. So simply, all you're going to do now is go to um, profile editor and type in uh, and click over here where it says new profile tick game directory and rename your file whatever you want to call it well today i'm gonna call it actually um ray so capital r e i pretty sure that's how you spell it so it's, it's the same as ray's minimap but i just call it ray so just click save profile and there you go it's over there so Simply what you want to do is go to profile at the top here, where I just opened it, click on Ray, which whatever you guys actually called it, sign in, um, let's just hope this is the right, whoops, gaming sensations, forgot the capital S, and I have no idea why I have my speakers turned on because I'm not actually using my headset at the moment. So let's try to remember. Okay, hopefully that's my password. Okay. Okay, there we are. Um, just simply log in like that. And as soon as that logs in, you can exit this as it says before. Wait for Minecraft to pop up. And I'm not sure if it's a black screen for you guys. But I simply press X pretty much. So next, what you're going to want to do is go to the start button, I have mine at the top, you guys might have your one at the bottom, like default side, um, on the right hand side, left hand side, it really doesn't matter guys, but all you simply do is click here, type in percent, app, um, data, data, whatever you guys actually want to call it, click on roaming, and when you click on roaming, click on dot minecraft, over here, you guys have these new fold well some new folders over here it says versions double click on versions and I've already had it installed but I'm just gonna simply delete that I don't know why I just went silent there I don't know um, and so pretty much click into it like click on 1.6.1 everyone should have this once you've installed 1.6.1 right click copy or you can do control C that works also so now go back um, make a new folder and call it whatever you called the profile whatever you called it down over here in Minecraft on the Minecraft launcher whatever you called your profile you call your folder over here so I called it array not capital E array I pretty much called it that double click on this control V or you can simply do um, right click and paste that's pretty much what you can do well, first thing that you're going to actually want to do at the moment here is just simply click like that so they're not both selected. Right click on this. Actually, um, yeah, first right click on this, rename, and call it exactly what your profile was named. And now you can rename this if we can select it. Rename, capital R, A, I. And there we go. Okay, so next, what you're going to want to do sorry guys I have a black nose at the moment my voice might be a little bit weird but oh well um, over here uh, you click on Ray the it's gonna be a jar file except my one at the moment is a WinRAR file which if you guys don't have WinRAR you guys should actually get that 
Hopefully you guys already have that. I'll maybe link it down in the description below. Hopefully if I remember. But I will be um, linking Rage Minimap down in the description below so you guys can actually download it. So simply shift and delete hold them both at the same time before before you do that first click on made it in then click yes and just simply delete this folder and then you're gonna be um, nearly done there pretty much extract the folder I extract the WinRAR file you, can, you guys might use something else but I use WinRAR it's a basic also you can use power ISO that also works but I use it simply right click and go extract files and you should it extract it in the folder it's in or on the desktop it, it extracts it into a folder over here as it is here Sim and simply highlight everything and drag and drop into it or you can do control V Remember, but first you have to click on this but let's forget about that click OK and there we are that's updated you can exit this raise minimap folder you can exit this over here and next you're gonna move on to here it's a dot json for um j s o n json whatever you guys want to call it except without an a the name json but yeah so what you can simply do is right click and go open with or something or just double click it because it might not be a notepad but i've already changed it and made it default to notepad so simply double click on this and where it says id here next to it where it says 1.6 simply highlight this and name it whatever your profile was named so i called it raise or Ray, whatever you guys want to um, call it, which it is phrase anyway. But you just simply rename it, no spaces, just highlight it exactly, and pretty much type in your profile name. And you can exit this, click save, of course. And then you can exit this, and simply what you're gonna want to do is open this over here. And let's wait for this to load as it does sometimes lag. Let's wait for this. Hopefully you guys can actually to see this. It's not just a black screen. Let's just wait for this. Okay. We're waiting, Mojang. Hello? Anyone home? Okay, there we are. So you're going to have your profile here. It's going to automatically be there. So you, I'm just going to simply click again on raise and click play. And guys, I will see you because I have to change the fraps and stuff, my different recording software. But I'll see you guys then. Peace. Okay, guys, welcome back. Um, as you can see, we're back into Minecraft over here. Let's simply click on single player. Well, that's what I'm gonna do. Also, guys, I am using Faith the Faithful Texture Pack as I showed you guys how to install a resource pack slash texture pack in my previous video uh, or one of my previous videos. So simply, all you're gonna want to do is click on your world, go to single player, multiplayer. It really doesn't matter. Uh, actually, it doesn't matter sometimes on multiplayer servers and stuff, but yeah, so as you can see here Right now we're in our world. I have my enchanted sword. It is a knockback 2 and sharpness 4 But yeah, so as you can see in the top right hand corner there is raised minimap Pretty much so this is my enchanting area. Um, I've showed you guys around here. I'm pretty sure Yeah, so Pretty much that's raised minimap. So you click M map to do a whole bunch of stuff see okay let's forget about this yeah so this, you have pretty much this stuff over here mm -hmm. raise minimum in the top right hand corner so you know what's happening there's my red sheep and stuff and holy shit there is also I'm not using the so I can't actually zoom in but yeah so that's pretty much how you install a texture pack I mean sorry a mod that's it, pretty much how you install a mod on Minecraft 1.6.2, hopefully on Minecraft 6.4 or 5 or 3 or 2, whatever they actually want to call it. It really doesn't matter yeah, as long as it stays the same and you simply remember what it is. But I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Please rate, comment and subscribe if you guys are new. It really helps me out if you guys do leave a like on this video because it really, really does help me out. So, yeah. Um... Uh, so also so you guys can be aware for any of the new mods that I might be reviewing or doing anything on them but I hope you guys enjoyed this also guys if you uh, if you want to show your friends how to install a mod or anything simply um, show them this video and it should help them out but yeah so that's pretty much it. until next time guys peace